Okay, how's everybody doing today? Uh, Clint, the audio guy here in Chris's workshop, my buddy, who happens to be a carpenter. Very uh, handy for stuff like this. Um, we've been working on the speaker again today, so here is the front baffle uh, with the veneer applied. We glued it, cramp, uh, clamped it, so this is wood glue, not paper-backed or wood-backed. Uh, it's supposed to stick the best. It is difficult to work with, the stuff splits and everything, so we may end up switching to paper-backed, but uh, right now we're trying this. Uh, we got it sanded down with 400 grit, so it's nice and smooth. We did a flush trim around it, so it's all cut out. Uh, this is oversized. It's about an inch too long and it's about a half inch too wide. So it's going to be trimmed on the CNC to size. Uh, we tested some stain. Not sure if we're going to stain the sides and back or uh, do a wood dye. But uh, this is a stain, ebony. It's kind of what, what I had pictured that and then varnish over it. Um, but it's it's a little blotchy. We'll see. It may require more coats, or we may have to do a wood dye or something. Uh, also, I decided to do a cross brace, and um, we put these together. This is it's so so perfectly fit that it's uh, it's just friction fit there. Like you can hit it and it doesn't move. Uh, <laughs> So, you know, want it tight to the side panels, and then it's going to hit the front baffle and the back. So on the front, we'll, we'll uh, do some domino joints into the baffle, as well as around the edges, and then, of course, glue. Um, here's the other one. So these are three-inch holes, four three-inch holes, and then a two-and-a-half-inch hole. I think that... Uh, we, we put a little uh, round over on it uh, just to uh, keep turbulence down. Uh, but uh, I think they came out pretty good. The I see, though, why manufacturers don't do full cross braces a lot because this is a lot of work. This was, uh, for one piece of wood, that's, that's a lot. Uh, we had to cut it out with these hole saws on the drill press, and then we had to clamp it all down and measure it all out, like... It's quite a bit to just to make some cross braces like that. But um, anyway, making some good progress. Um, we will, here's the other one. Um, when I get some more done, uh, I will be back with some more updates. But it's looking pretty cool right now. All right, well, everybody have a good one. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one.